Wah! Master Wong, you have big problem now. Wolfman down with the Wong. I was down with the Wong, but now you copy. Now you copy my video from 2014. Learn UFC MMA. Ku Ang Bok Muburan round counter round kick counter to leg locks. Master Wong, you have big big problem now. You copy my video. I was down with the Wong. Even few days ago, I practiced old peaceful Master Wong teaching Tai Chi on golf course. I learned to do Su Lim Tao. But now you copy video without giving Wolfman credit. You have big problem, Master Wong. I'm gonna show everyone video from 2014. You totally copy. Round kick catch to insert leg lock. Shin compression, knee compression. You copy my learn UFC MMA cool round kick catch counter Mui Bran Ong Bonk leg lock video. Master Wong, you have big problem now. You end up in prison with Wolfman, I eat your ass. I break off your leg, I sell one on eBay. I keep one so they can never put back together. Watch a video, you see, Master Wong, copy me. Master Wong, I challenge you, fight now. You, I beat you with Wing Chun, I beat you with JKD, I beat you with MMA, I beat you with, kick your ass. You have big, big problem. Hey guys, Dan the Wolfman here, thecombatsystem.com. I'm gonna show you some cool MMA slash street stuff. Uh, different variations you can do against round kick le leg catches, okay, against body kicks. Uh, I don't like the right body kick for MMA. It's way too instinctual, too easy to grab. Um, but I'm going to show you some cool stuff you can do, a little on bonk style, uh, either for MMA or for the street. Anyway, some cool stuff. Okay, so uh, let's go with the jab right body kick first. I'm going to catch that jab coming in, and I, but I catch the kick and I whip him off balance, right? People are used to getting it. It's so common that they go to punch you right away. Boom, I lean back and I give him this knee. It doesn't have to even be that hard, but it's nasty. As he punches, I lean back, I give him this knee. Then I can enter in with on bump, knee, elbow, okay, muy boy on style. Now that would be a 12-6 elbow in MMA, but you like to have fun and do real mixed martial arts sometimes. I mean, maybe it was 1FC. I, I think it's allowed, I'm not sure. Um, but the 12-6 elbow, it'd be okay. Here, here. Now from there, I can biomechanically hit his knee and rotate him. Now from there, I do what I want. I just dumped him if it was a Muay Thai fight. He has to spend energy to get up. Now I could try and snap the knee a little bit with a fast heel hook, even though he's not real isolated. I can then step over to a hold here, okay? Insert the leg, the shin behind the knee. And now I can just lean forward and it puts a lot of pressure on the knee with the shin. As well as if I got the foot here, it's gonna lock him even faster. If it slips off on the side, that's fine, because I like to go camel clutch style, make him tap out from that. If there was a street, I could grab his hair and bang his face into the mat. This is also a very good control position. Uh, you see this leg lock in like Sula and other systems. It's a good leg control position to hold someone in, because it doesn't take energy to just hold someone there for police to come and whatnot for the street. But for the mat, it's also a lot of fun. I'll show that one more time. I go here, catch, boom, he goes to punch me. Bam, oh yeah, bam, bam, hold this. Here, turn it down, step over, insert, and now I got the leg lock. I got camel clutch, okay, all at the same time, very good control position. I can do what I want to. Chill out, man, chill out, call 911, call the police, whatever needs to be done. Okay, as long as you exhale. Okay, so I'll show that again. Here, here, okay. Now, from here I got options. One thing I would like to do here, Come in with that knee, elbow, knee, elbow, spinning home. Okay? So a little bit more around, a little bit John Jones style. Here. Okay? Boom. Wah, 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 wah. Okay? Okay? So uh, let's get that one more angle before I go on another one. Okay. Uh, come here. That's good. Ready? Okay, so a little fun, because it teaches you spinning elbow, some stuff like that. Okay, now let's go into some other options. Again, on the right kick, here, here, okay? Now I could lead with this, he punches, okay? And now I'm gonna go 
you, yeah, give me that punch. Boom. As he punches, boom, I'm going to come back and find that wrist. I'm going to kick an oblique kick to that knee and go to a heel hook, go to a leg lock position. So I'm going to fall back and drag him to the ground this way. Insert the leg here. Switch this to behind the knee. Okay, my right foot went from oblique to a behind the leg insert. This is flat on the ground where I'm locking the hip. I can come in a little tighter maybe. And now I'm ready to really rip this if I needed to. Okay, so just insert here, go very slow in training. Heel hooks are very dangerous. And then I can rotate the heel as well as also counter rotate my body. Okay, but what stops them from rolling out, make sure you get that, my foot over here, is, is this foot, okay? So, one more time on that. Boom, he goes to punch, bam, here. Find that, grab that, insert, fall, here. Lock down here, boom, and now I'm ready to, okay? Heel hook, slowly, nice way. Or, if I needed to. Or I could also rotate my body, okay? As well as all this kind of variations, okay? Okay, on the other side, I could do that as well. Against the left, okay? Yeah, so now, on this side, here. Now, if I wanted, I could come in, whatever. I could just go to this. I could go for a knee first. I could go for this. I could roll in and sit at the same time. I could insert here. Now, I kind of lost this leg. Actually, that's okay. Um, now I might decide to come up. Because I could heel hook him here, but he might also roll. Because I lost this leg. Hey, that happened. So now I might decide to insert and go to the move that I showed you earlier. Now I'm here in total control. I also got the foot. Good by my hip bone. Okay, so it's a knee compression lock uh, or calf slice or whatever. But really, if my shin is behind his knee, and I'm also doing this to him. So I could take his toes, put him up his butt, I could toe hold him here, or I could toe press him. Okay, let's go one more time just because you feel weird. Yeah, now I can insert that there. So he's trapped, so he can't cop wear out. So I switch this time from this to this here. Now I can slowly, or if need be, I could go here, I could go and turn my body while this is hooked. Uh, I'm showing some dangerous stuff for street combatives applications, but this is good, practice safe, kind of fun to do with your class, MMA stuff. And again, I could go heel hook here, I could bail out, I could always scissor out, transition, come up uh, like Oliveira did, that knee compression in UFC, John Oliveira. So anyway guys, I hope you liked it. It's just kind of mixing a bunch of stuff together. Uh, one more thing before we go, just the biomechanics on one of this takedown. If I got a kick here, I can just insert my arm. I could hit, I could elbow, even without the elbow, I could just kind of insert and slide with a little bit of pressure and look what it does to him. So I'm going to biomechanically take his knee from here and point it down. And even if it was Muay Thai, right, I hit him in the face, he hit me in the face, I want that takedown, maybe I can't get the sweep. He's got good balance, BJ Penn style. I'm having trouble hopping in to reap that leg or to dump him this way. I could always just go here. Throw him down, even in Muay Thai. Okay, so that's something uh, people should know. So one more time on that. Let's go this way. Okay, so we're here. Here, 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 boom. I can insert this way with my elbow. Can you get back up? <laughs> You want here. Even his knees pointed up now, I'm still gonna have a little bit of trouble, but I could whip him and I can use this form, whip him here, turn him down. Now he's mine. Okay, I got him down. I can just dump him, knee strike him, I can kick him in the head, whatever. Just biomechanically understand it doesn't take a lot to turn that knee down. I'll show on the other side one time. Here. Okay, here. So, and guys, always exhale. Okay, I'm not really, because I'm not really concerned about the kick, but here. Slide, elbow insert. Okay, start from here. Just kick and guy. Whoa! Even if we tie, if I kicked right away, that'd actually be allowed. So, anyway, I hope you enjoyed it, guys, and please sub. Uh, thanks.